वेलकम टू द यूट्यूब चैनल जस्ट इन्फॉर्मेशन आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन टुडे वी विल लर्न क्लास एट मेंटल एबिलिटी पार्ट टू इन दिस पार्ट वी विल लर्न मोर क्वेश्चंस डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चंस सो आर थर्ड क्वेश्चन इज Who is the eldest of them? Like this type of questions. In that, listen the question carefully. The question is, Malini is younger than Lina. Malini is younger than Lina. Means Lina is oldest. रूपाली इज ओल्डर दैन लीना एल्डर दैन लीना मीन्स रूपाली इज मोर ग्रेटर रानी इज यंगर दैन मालिनी मीन्स रानी इज स्मॉल दैन मालिनी आंसर द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन इन दैट फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज हु इज द एल्डेस्ट ऑफ दैम Who is the eldest of them? First, Malini. Second, Rupali. Third, Lina. Fourth, Rani. Second is who is the youngest of them? Who is the youngest of them? First is Rani. Second is Lena. Third is Rupali. Fourth is Malini. Now let's move towards first question. It is who is the eldest of them? Eldest means who is the most big sister in them or big girl in them. So, in this while reading the question, we have write wrote it in a sequence. In that this capital R means Rupali. Rupali is the eldest of them. Therefore, our answer is option number two. Rupali is young, uh, oh, eldest. Eldest means older, the very big person in the whole group. The second, who is the youngest of them? Youngest means the smallest one, the youngest. Rani is the smallest we have written. So, Rani, option number one. is the smallest youngest in them i hope you have understood this type of question now let's move towards the question number 4 fourth is a bit different question it is given that in a row a is standing on the eighth place In a row, A is standing on the eighth place. We can assume that this is the eighth place. A is standing on the eighth place. B is standing before A. B is standing before A. Means at this point. C is standing on the ninth place. This is A on eighth place. Sorry, uh, C is standing on the ninth place behind B. Behind B. On the ninth place. Means this is one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. Sorry, 
वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन सी स्टैंडिंग ओवर हेयर डी स्टैंडिंग ऑन दी थर्ड प्लेस बिफोर सी बिहाइंड बी आंसर सॉरी बिहाइंड बी मेंस वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन एट दिस पॉइंट सी स्टैंडिंग ऑन दिस पॉइंट बिहाइंड बी वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन D standing on the third place before C. One, two, three. Third place before C. How many students are before D? Before D, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six over here and. A is on the eighth place means before this is seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. So sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleventh, twelfth place. From this the positions of standing are started. So therefore, twelfth place. Given options are. First is eleven, second is fourteen, third is twelve, fourth is thirteen. Means option number three twelve is the correct option. Now we will try the twenty. Uh, uh, sorry, fifth question. Fifth question is in a row. Amar is on the fifth place. A row. Amar is on the fifth place. Amar is on the fifth place. Let's assume this is the fifth point. Jayesh is on the fifth place behind Amar. Means one, two, three, four, five. Here Jayesh is standing. Jayesh is on the sixth place before Prakash. Before Prakash means Prakash will be one, two, three, four, five, six. Jayesh is on the sixth place before Prakash, so and here Prakash will be standing. Then how many students are there before Prakash? Before Prakash. Uh, Before that, before A there was uh, A was on the fifth place. So before A there will be four places. Four, three, two, one. At this point, the standing line were started. So Prakash is on the this point. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Fifteen. An option is given. First is sixteen. Second is fifteen. Third is fourteen. And fourth is thirteen. We have counted that fifteen places are before there. Prakash. So therefore, our correct answer is fifteen. Fifteen. I hope you have understood this part too, and how the Prakash is standing on the fifteenth, on the sixteenth place, and before him fifteen students are standing. I hope you have understood this. For any queries and doubt, you can join the Telegram link given in the description of this video. Like this is the foundation of class eight. We have covered the foundation of class seventh too. the links are given in the description of this video please go and check through it in part 3 we will learn more questions based on mental ability but different from this type learned in this part
आई होप यू हैव अंडरस्टूड थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग